come by for that drink you offered, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. <laughs> okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look, I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years. And I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> You look like a good kid, but if you want my advice, you give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe, just maybe, if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Then you can rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? What you saw the other day was a guy dealing with pests. I guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well, and today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? No. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot. Who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that. I tell you what. <sighs> Least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. <sighs> it's not too far from here. Let's go. All right, man. I'm following you. Let's take Amanda's car. Hey, Jim. I'm going for a drink with... Dad, shit! I'm in our boat going down the Western Highway. It's... it's been stolen. What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane! All right, I'm coming. For my boat! All righty then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. I'll do what I can to help with that, man. Number one, don't ever have kids. Hey, man, look, if I had kids, I don't think no parenting issues would arise over who had boat privileges and who don't. Shit, motherfuckers would be lucky to sit in a bathtub. Shit, things that desperate, huh? Nah, but, you know, shit, I was making a point. Pathologizing self-deprecation. I know it well. Yeah, man, but shit, where the boat at? Little shit's been hijacked. They're somewhere on the Western Highway. Man, ain't you worried? About my boat? Yeah, I am. But you can always buy another boat. Yeah, tell my accountant that. Man, you can always get credit for one. But have you come repo it? No, thank you. <laughs> All right, homie. I ain't your homie. I'm someone you want to impress. Really? Man, I thought you was retired. Why the fuck do I want to impress some slipper-wearing motherfucker? Because I can still teach you a thing or two. Maybe help you open the door to all the joys that boat-related parenting issues entail. So I'm gonna help you get this boat back, right? That you are, my friend. Oh! There! There! There it is! That's my boat! Your boat's in a fucking hurry, man! Yeah, well, we'll catch him!
We got a plan? Sure. Once I get us up close, you're the board part. More like the falling in traffic party. You'll be fine. If anything happens, I got a piece of the glove box. I'll cover you. Oh, yeah, man, fine. Just fucking fine. So you thought of everything, right? Well... Kill me. If you fall to your uh, death, I'm gonna fucking kill you! Right now. I paid five years of ah. sin! Oh. The fuck is wrong with you, kid? Dad! Don't dad me, you little shit! You better hope she's still seaworthy! Shit. Shit. Ah, shit! Fuck, kid! Hey! Get me off this damn thing! Hey, close! I ain't getting away. Fuck! Hey, get right up the back Shit. of that thing! I can't keep up. Fuck! Yeah. Now that doesn't sound good. Damn, that's the engine, man. We ain't chasing shit in this thing. Come on, stay with me. Stay with me. Ah, my fucking boat! Hey, it's just a thing. At least you still got a son. Hey, it's a chop shop back there, dog. You drive us there, we can get the ride fit. My boat. It's just a thing. My boat. Please stop doing that. Listen. I fucked up, okay? I'm not going to lie, that was a really bad judgment call. But shit, Dad, I nearly died, and all you give a shit about is this fucking boat! No, it's not that, it's... All we do is scream at each other. No wonder I can't get a job. It's all your fucking fault. Or, it's not, but it's partly your fault. I... I mean, I just want to impress you. By selling my boat to some gangbangers? I know it sounds dumb when you put it like that, but all you do is daydream or get angry. Look, I love you, Jimmy, but you're an asshole. And right now, with my boat disappearing over the horizon, that's all I can see. Franklin, do you do me a favor and give this kid a ride home after they fix this thing? I want to headbutt the road in peace. Oh, great! Leave me with the home invader! I'll get it done, dog. No problem. Dad! Enough, all right? Enough! Hey, Franklin, can you call me a cab? Sure thing, man. Hey, I need a cab as soon as you can send one. 
Los Santos Customs by the airport. All right, thanks. Thanks, man. Hey, so you uh do much yachting? Not anymore. No, I don't. Before, I mean, man. No, no not really. This little shit stays in his room all day, and I don't have any other people to go with, you know? I like looking at it. Looking? Yeah. You know, I'd come down to the marina, sit on the dock, pour myself a drink, and look at it. Jacqueline. Did it clear my head, you know? Let me dream. Jacqueline, huh? Well, maybe you need to do some other shit to fill your time. Dream other dreams, man. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Hey, this the place up here. I know this dude, man. His name How. He gonna look after me. All right, take what's in my pocket. A couple thousand bucks. That'll cover it, right? So you sure you're good? Yeah, I got this. All right. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna come up front. Get out and walk around. It's okay, I can just climb over. Look, man, I'm gonna get the ride fixed, man. They dropped it back off at your house along with this dude. It's all good, though, man. You go and get your head right, all right? All right, listen, thanks for today. I appreciate it. You stop back out to the house, we'll talk. Ugh, you see? Show, sure, man. Hey, sorry we didn't get your boat, man. Yeah. Come on, man. Let's trick this whip, homie. need to get you out for one of the races, Franklin. See if you drive as fast as you talk. From a we can dish to it. A Sweet. Damn it! I'm gonna take you home now. It's Franklin, right? Yeah, Franklin. On the credit for our guy. The home invader. You know what? Call me what you like, man. Yeah, I, I, no, I, I mean, sure. Jimmy, ain't it? Or James? Jimmy. Or just like, Jizzle? <laughs> no, nah, man, I'll just stick with Jimmy, homie. So, uh... Oh, oh man! Why, dog? Well, what's the deal, man? Huh? You and my old man? I see you at the dealership. And someone steals my whip, and Papa's all like, he's been down there to talk to you guys. Your Pops did more than talk. What'd he do? Look, man, if he ain't tell you, I ain't gonna tell you. But I lost my fucking... Fuck! But I lost my fucking job, and I thought maybe he could help me find a new one. Dude, my dad is retired. Like, fully? Like, his only marketable skills are watching TV and daytime drinking. <sighs> man, look, I don't know, homie. He seems okay to me. Shit, he saved your ass. You saved my ass. Nah, nah, man. Well, well, maybe we good together, you know? Like, maybe we can get shit done we couldn't do separate. If it keeps him out of the house, that's cool by me. <sighs> yeah, well, we'll see. Look, I'm sorry my dad lost to your job. It's hard out there. Tough. <laughs> shit! I mean, I'm employmentally challenged at the moment. Oh, you got fired, dude. Damn, that's rough. Not fired as such. I didn't get a job. I've been there, homie. You've been putting them resumes out there, but no one's hiring, huh? No, I, uh, I didn't get a job. I've never had a job. It feels like hard work. Life, the days just kind of disappear. Hey, you play right to slaughter? Nah, not since the first couple. Okay. Yo, so, like, since we're both unemployed, like, we could run together, you know? Yeah, I think about it, homie. Or, or we could just, like, shop it, you know? Play darts or get our drink on? Strip clubs? Come on, dude. I get real crazy. Yeah, I got your number, shit. I need it, man. But, uh, hey, hey you know what? Man, go easy on your pops, dog. All right? All right, church. <laughs> exactly, man. My brother from another mother. I mean, I, I hope so, because my mom was kind of a skank back in the day. See ya. Yeah, whatever, homie. Peace.
Amen. Tracy. Yo. Amanda! Amanda! You better not be! Not in my house! Fuck you, Michael! Go away! I'm paying that turd 150 bucks an hour to fuck my wife in my own bed? Michael, go away! Oh, I'm sorry, bro. She said you had an arrangement. You and I are gonna have an arrangement. I'm gonna arrange your fucking funeral. I'm really sorry, bro. I'll comp the session. I promise. You are dead, man! Uh, Fuck! Dead! Uh, Come here! Uh, What's up, man? Get out of my way. Michael, calm down. What the fuck is going on? Nothing happened. It was a misunderstanding. She fucked the frick in my bed. <laughs> Bullshitting. It wasn't like that. You in? Fuck it. I'm in. Let's roll. Let's get this motherfucker. Just don't kill him! <laughs> this truck your? Guy's doing some work for me. He'll get it back. Might have a dead body to do it, but he'll get it back. Oh, so we killing this dude? You wish he was dead. Is that a problem? Shit, a dog shit shit in another dog's kennel. Exactly. People been shitting in my kennel for too long. Off to the left, right there. Shit, we're losing him. I think we lost his ass. He lives somewhere up in the canyon. We'll find him. You see that little piece of shit? It's this track here. Hey! You know, one of these fucking houses? Yeah, keep your eye out. That's his car, right there. Little prick's up there, look. Oh, shit! Cole's doing all right for himself. Hey! Asshole! You ran off before we could settle our debts! Michael, fuck! You got the wrong idea, man! Banging married women's a hobby, not a fucking profession! There's a winch in the back of the truck. Tied a cable to one of those supports up there. You finna pull his deck down? Hey, that prick pulled my marriage down. Man, you really gonna be this fucking dramatic? Yeah, whatever. I told you I comped the session, bud. Well, there were a lot of freaking sessions, bud. I'm thinking you were working on more than just her backhand. Mandy's backhand has come a long way, bro. But sometimes it's gotta get worse to get better. Yeah, well, maybe I should come up there and practice my backhand. On your face! Oh, bud, your negative energy is seriously bringing me down. Oh, I hope it is, bud. We hooked up, man. You come into my house, take my money, and nail my wife? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm gonna stick up my hand and say that was uncool, bud. My bad. Seriously. Oh, how fucking magnanimous. May I please offer you my applause? You fucking motherfucker! No! And we'll see how you like it when someone fucks with your shit! Oh, hey! Wait! You got the wrong idea, pal! Whoa! Fuck! Here we go! Ha-ha! <laughs> Let's see what happens! Dude, you are probably crazy! <laughs> oh, shit! You see this shit, dog? Do it, man! Fuck it, do it! I think that shit's coming down, man. Man, fucking drop it. Are you fucking serious, nigga? Ah! Fucking A. Let's see how he like that. Whoa, man. Fuck. Fuck him. And yeah, fuck his deck. 
Hey, homie, I think you put a little more than a deck down. That's a foolish man who builds his house on sand, baby. Hey, man, I don't think my boy Matthew was thinking truck when he wrote that shit. Mr. DeSanta, what the hell? That's not my house! Bullshit. Oh, bro, I couldn't afford a place like that. I'm a tennis coach. I hit balls for a living. I was just hiding there. Give me a phone! You! You're a dead one! Green light! Green light! Martin Madrazo, give you green light! Oh, I'm scared, lady. Just fucking terrified. <laughs> Green light! Green light! Not Madrazzo! Fuck you! Whoa! Home! You got Martin? Martin Madrazzo? That's what she said. Damn, dude's a kingpin, homie. Man, you better hope. I ain't hoping anything. Chick was a stir. And chill out. That coach should be doing the Russian broad. Chick needs to chill the Shit! We got some heavies on us, homie. Are you kidding me? Kid, can you do something? I'll give it a go, man. Keep trying. Think about this. Wow. Shit. You did good. I mean, your aim's all over the place, but you were a help. Ah, uh, thanks. I guess. Hey, don't get. Don't get defensive. Go to a shooting range. Work on your aim. You'll do fine. Oh fuck, man. Shit, you good? Fine as wine. Got a few knocks. You okay? I mean, you did good, kid. Man, I'm cool, man. I mean, you mentally. Mentally. Oh, man, I'm fucking excellent. My heart ain't fucked like that in years. Oh, yes, fucking A, Bubba. Man, you sound kind of manly. You just been greenlit by the Mexican underworld ambassador to Los Santos. Trust me, we handled it. Wherever the fuck Martin Madrazo is, I've known worse. We just handled a few low-ranking clients. We sit on it. What the fuck? We see what happens. Kid. There's no use second. No use second guessing. Feels good, man. Woo! Yeah. Do it something for a change. Man, you know what? You are wasted sitting by that fucking pool, man. You're right. I need to do something. Scotch and sunshine is sitting on my ass. Fuck that. I'm better than that. Damn Skippy, homie. All that knowledge up there is withering and dying, dawg. You don't pass that shit on, it's gone, homie. I bet you know some shit. You wouldn't believe the shit I know. Yeah? You taking some score? There was a time, that was all I did. Shit, well, you know, I could tell you some shit, too. Yeah, like what? About this city I was born and raised in. Now think about it. Yeah, do that, man. This could be cool. Hey, thanks for the help out there today, kid. I had no idea it was gonna get that hot. Shit, pulling houses off the hillside? Sure has a weird way of fucking with people. Yeah, well, I thought I was through with all that shit. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh, shit, I think we're about to find out. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? Do you? No. Do you? You? I think so. Good. I know who you are. I know where you live. Who are you? I'm Franklin. License. Now, Franklin. Maybe help Mr. DeSanta here. Who am I? I think Martin Madrazo. Good boy. Now maybe give him a little of the background. Man, Mr. Madrazo. 
it, Mr. Madrazo is a legitimate businessman who was wrongfully accused of running a Mexican-American gang and a narcotic ring, but the charges were dropped because of the witnesses came up missing. Smart kid. Now, Michael, got a question for you. Uh, what did you pull an architectural, significant, modernist, wonder home down the hillside in Vinewood Hills? I thought the owner was banging my wife. Well, that was a strange house for a tennis coach. <sighs> I wasn't thinking straight. Mm, clearly. Yeah. <sighs> well, Natalia will need a hotel while you finance the rebuilds, won't she? Sure. Good. And I'm guessing here that the rebuilds uh, will be somewhere in the 2.5 million range? <laughs> of course. Great. That's nice. Come on, man. Damn, you all right? Never better. So what now? Looks like I'm gonna have to postpone my retirement. Fuck. Ah, oh, man, I'm mortgaged up to my eyeballs. Look, I only know one way to make money. I'm gonna have to give an old friend a call. Lester. I think he's in town somewhere. I'm gonna have to track him down. Just give me a little alone time, all right? All right, dog. Is this still the number for Lester Crest? Who's asking? Who's asking? Who's asking? You're awful cagey. <laughs> <clears throat> Even for a dead man, Michael. Ooh, you don't sound good, buddy. <laughs> Tactful and charming, even in death. Hey, come see me, old friend. I'm living in Los Santos, just like you. Marietta Heights. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hey, how do you... Hello? You fucker. Doc, hey. Michael, well, I'm looking through my appointment book, and I don't see your name. Yeah, well, I'm more of a walk-in guy, Doc. You know that. Walk-ins are more expensive, but I'm always happy to accommodate. Sure, you'll accommodate me as long as I got money in my pocket, right? Hey, I'm in a bad way, Doc. I might come by soon. Mm -hmm. 